For, for like, for the last seven or so years, I get postcards. I try to send them every, every show or, uh, and this they're not gonna like because it's all the same one, which is, there's gonna, they're not gonna be happy about that. But I write one to each of my daughters and send them out and figure when they're in therapy, when they're older. I'll have some proof I was making an effort. Steve Kellogg. Are you guys plan on doing this for a living or? Yep, just uh, trying to write better songs. Gonna choose some light. Gonna drink wine. Bound to win a few fights before my time. Gonna make a love now. Ain't the future bright. doing all the same gigs we were working really hard and we, we did a bunch of touring together lots of like going to gigs where nobody would come you know <laughs> that time was so very simple so i'm gonna start with this song right here some and you lose some and uh, when you're losing it's nice to have friends I called this man and I said I need you to catch a few flights sleep for an hour and come out here and play with us he said I can't wait coming all the way from the east coast Mr. Stephen come on Humble is the word. He doesn't use his talent to get further. He's always using his talent to connect. Gonna be a good friend. Gonna be a family guy. Yeah. Gonna pour my heart out till the day after I die. And when I am an angel looking for a land. Gonna be the last man standing Gonna be the last man Gonna be the last You know, if I could admire something about him, it is that he's never satisfied. He, he always wants to go farther. Gonna be the last man. Doesn't seem to have a way to Gonna shut the, the tap off. Um, that's a real artist because he can't control it. I think he just is wide open. I'm gonna be the last man. Gonna be the last man. Gonna be the last man standing tonight. Hey guys. Gonna be the last man standing tonight. You know, yeah, I'm in an interesting phase in my career here. It's not my first rodeo, but I'm not a, a nostalgia act, you know? But you do learn some things, and there are several things that I, that I wish someone had shared with me when I was starting out, you know? And I think probably one of the best pieces of advice I ever got was, uh, if you take care of the music, the music will take care of you. You know, so often people don't wear their hearts on their sleeves. So often people are afraid to talk about what's happening to them. And so often people don't, you know, let things get out into the world, music get out into the world that isn't honed. And he exudes optimism and he exudes in his music a belief in our abilities to transcend and persevere. This is not how I had intended to, uh, to start the concert, but I, um... Here's the thing, I feel like when your hands are shaking, that's when you're really living. And, and I wrote a song about 45 minutes ago, and I'd like to play it for you right now. For all the things 
times that I regret Things I thought would come to pass Things that haven't happened yet I would be a rich man But they're just things And you do the best you can uh, 15 years, about a little over 1,500 shows in the last 15 years. I do this because uh, I don't feel that I have an option. Anytime I've even tried to put it down or deviate from getting up on stage and sharing my songs and my point of view, I just feel like I'm selling myself out if I do that. So I have to do it. I'm utterly compelled to do it. And, uh, and it's, it's also how I feed my family, so that's no small shake, you know? It's the thing I've had the most success in in my life. So, you, uh, you know, you, you play the cards you're dealt. This hotel just makes me lonesome without you. There is marble and a fireplace and a panoramic view. I know that you were serious when you said that we were true. This hotel just makes me lonesome without you. I was thinking about the man I thought I'd uh, SK, uh, Stephen, and I, we've written songs together for a long time. He's one of my favorite lyricists uh, in the world. I, I love He's the... somebody who has no boundary when it comes to expressing himself. In other words, when he's writing something, I don't think he's thinking, wow, this is really going to expose me, so I'm not going to write this. I think Stephen is brave, you know? So as an artist, he's an artist artist. <laughs> is pretty much the most honest music I've ever listened to in my life. It's like he's writing in his diary or something. So the kids ask me if we are safe And it's all I can do to look them in the face And say maybe we are, maybe we are We've been dealt a good hand, we've been lucky so far But what else can I truthfully say? My songs come from, they're one of three things. They're either my life and the way I see it, uh, the people around me's life and the way that I see that, or what I believe to be true, even if I haven't seen it. Um, but in all three cases, I try to tell the truth. The whole set tonight is just songs I've never played off an album that's not out yet. So that's like the whole motif of this show, but it's, you know, freaking scary. I'm like, okay, there's not one sure thing in the whole batch. Well, you know, the, the new album is, is quite literally all over the map. It has all these different genres, but um, I, I was able to do the different genres because, you know, for the first time in 10 years, I wasn't on a record label and there was nobody telling me to pick a lane. So I didn't have to pick a lane. It is ambitious, but for some reason, Southwest, Northeast seemed like, it seemed easier, because it was, uh, 
it's in, it's in compartments, you know? It was four or five songs for South, four or five songs for West, four or five songs for North. It kind of became obvious which songs belonged with which co-producers and in which environments. You know, the ones that uh, ended up on South, for instance, they just had that kind of old school Southern rock feeling. shows that we're doing right now um, are we're previewing the songs from Southwest Northeast. Album's not out yet, taking these songs out, playing nothing but new songs for the whole show. And uh, just like seeing how it all feels, you know, and uh, sharing it for the first time. Do you remember who we were when all of this began? Half finished thoughts and pregnant pause. I'm sorry. I'm a professional. Half finished thoughts and pregnant pauses. It's not as though we had a plan. As keeping up with Joneses was a game where we prepared to play. Somebody's daughter turning tricks just to make it through the day. Remember passing time, shooting stars, if only we were in charge. At the farm here, or the studio. These are baby sheep. Over that way. Just arrived here to make West. When we were making West, I stayed out in a barn. Uh, Gregory Allen Isakoff has a barn, and there's a sheep on one side, and then my cot on another side, and then on the other side of that wall was the studio. So you're literally sleeping in the woods. There's no mirrors, there's no internet out there. Um, there's a typewriter in the room. So that's gonna have an impact on the way that music sounds. You know? There's a freedom saying what you need to say. But once you do, the cat won't get back in the bag. This is the studio. Those are the newly hung Can't guitars. Imagine living A lot of times I come home at the end of the night, and you may know what this is like, but um, the people that you love, like when you see them sleeping, you're like, I love you again. Like even if you've had like an issue or whatever, you know, it's the, the, there's this moment, you know, and you want to wake them up and be like, try to say everything that you feel. But, you know, if you do, they'll just be like, have bad breath and be like, what? You know, why are you waking me up? But you envision like how that would go. I'm happy. But I've got an angry heart Live in a world so dark Sometimes I can't see What's in front of me And I get scared And hey darling I notice that you're still sad It's written on your forehead That you get no peace when you sleep, and that's not fair. I wish you could see this light that surrounds you in the night. And I hope 
My friend knew of him because he was in a band, a high school band. He just started to hang out with us and just all of a sudden just jumped on like top of a, a bench and just started being his silly self and just uh, like, I'm gonna be a rock star someday. And being silly, like humorous guy, I had never met anyone like that. When I get within two miles of my house, my foot just pushes down on the gas and I can just feel like every fiber of my body just starts to just sink into this exaltation. It's incredible coming home. And, I, and it happens every time. It's like, it's a rush. Hey, babe. How are you, honey? How are you? I missed you too so much. I loved, oh my gosh, your costumes were incredible yesterday. Thank you. You gotta tell me all about it, okay? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. <sighs> oh my God, this has been so nuts. Shows have been good though. Well, that's all gone really well. Just trying to get these mixes knocked down too, because I just don't think it's like right yet. How you doing though? How was the day? Did you guys go to? You went to the parade? North is where I actually live, and I kind of that that part of the album came out sparse. North is the closest thing that I have to that I've ever made to being like an indie rock sounding record. The wolf by the ear. When I wrote Learn to Live, I had that picture of my daughter there. Uh, and I was very focused on the fact that, that that song and that message could maybe save her life someday if I wasn't around to share it. And that's really the, the point, I think, of what I do. I mean, you want to save someone's life, you, you know? So often, music is a footnote in people's lives but it's an opportunity or, or the possibility of being something more. And so you wanna, you wanna go after big, big things. You wanna move people in a big way. The hat actually looks, it looks cooler on you. I gotta get a new hat. I'm definitely like, that hat's, I'm about done with it. I don't know why you have been crying. No one here would be denied. There's been sadness, there's been pain Things will never be the same There's a choice you must be making And it's simple if you try You can learn to live with the fear you feel Or you can learn to die like a fabric that is ugly torn and frayed hold on hold on cause the healing's in the man and then you wish that you had stayed there's a choice you must be making you must make it every Bye. day Bye, you can learn to face the mistakes you you can't look the other way Learn to die with the things you did But you can't learn to live Southwest, Northeast, so there, it's kind of like four different 
genres that just kind of, it's like me just freaking out and getting to be like, I'm a southern rock guy. It's like me and Will Hogue around a mic. And then like, and then it's like me out west in a barn, like being a cowboy. And then it's like me with Kit and Chip in like, in like, in, in, uh, in DC, like acting like I'm Jason Mraz. So it's kind of like, it's, it's, it's a really disjointed album. I'm gonna be the last man standing in the night. I, I wrote this, is this, is Joe's, this is 21 plus, this is like, there's like no kids here. So, you know when you have sex, um, <laughs> and after you, after the sex is done, you, um, you're in like a position that you can never recreate <laughs> under any circumstances. Like you can't, if one of you gets up to go to the bathroom or turn off the light or do like anything else, like that position's gone. But it's an amazing thing because you can be seriously twisted and tangled in ways that you can never get back in and I love that I like miss that so much both from just now my kids are like someone being intimate in there we want to come in I miss that feeling of just being like tangled and be like I'm just gonna crash now and fall asleep and that's what this song's about that's no, it's about love it's about love <laughs> After the noise dies down There's only honesty that fills the space around The nothing is the scary part The silences we know by heart But you are a galaxy you are surrounding me. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. You watching over me. All that my eyes can see. Whoa, oh, oh, oh. Whoa, oh, oh. The vibe of East is really different. It's interesting that that's where the record ends. That's the last part of it. But it's, uh, it's a little more, uh, pop than the other than the other parts of the record it's uh um, we took some chances with non-organic instruments which is pretty rare in my music that doesn't happen very often uh so it kind of sounds to me it sounds it sounds like a pop record but it's really funny because i play it for my friends who are actually pop artists and they're like man you make such cool roots music <laughs> i know i'm not the first star dear To shadow through your atmosphere Cause you are a <laughs> My struggles, man, my struggles making art and music you want to make, saying what you need to say, but also making sure that somehow, some way, this thing that has supported your family for 15 years is going to continue to do that. But the thing I'd say about that is you can never underestimate the importance of staying true to what it is you do. If you have something you absolutely need to do or need to say, you have to do it. And I've gotten that wrong a few times and it feels really bad. Cool. Chips, hit, hit, just hit me again, load me up again, please. So huddle together in the wind and try to stay strong. Protect your own. His writing is, is good for me to, to remember. You can be a, a true explainer of, of emotion and give that to people so that they can, you know, sometimes it's helpful. I do believe a song is like, a, a, like medicine. You know, if you, if you take it at the right time, you know, it makes you feel better. Beyond the shadow of a doubt There's a devil He has shown us his face got this call from a friend in LA and he's like, Is that, are you guys okay? I heard about this shooting at the school. 
Um, and then we put on the news, and it's Newtown, which is a mile that way. And you heard that right. It is unthinkable, an elementary school. You know, just like the absolute worst day of my life. 21st graders, six teachers. You know, and those kids all go to school now here in our town. And The majority of those who died today were children. Uh, beautiful little kids between the ages of 5 and 10 years old. Hearts that never beat again All is black now And they say the hate won't win There's so much emotion there that you kind of feel like you need to write about it, but I, I just couldn't, I wasn't going to just write like, hey, this horrible thing happened. So I didn't write about uh, it for a really long time, and it wasn't until considerably later that I addressed some of those emotions and you come to the conclusion that there's very little that you can do in the face of such unspeakable darkness. but. Um, you don't know, we're all like, we're all just deer in the woods and you try to stick together. Um, but when the worst happens, you know, the, the thing you always at least have is that she is, and it's the last line of the song, is huddle together in the wind. Huddle together in the wind And die in each other's arms Because sometimes that's all you have, you know? Still crushes me. <laughs> I thought tonight went well. Tonight's one of the good ones, so I get to feel good, connected. And so now you can take the rest of the night off, even though it's 1220. Rest and you got a 530 uh, lobby call for a flight to North Carolina. You do the best you can. Oh, you do the best you can. And have I done the best? Only God knows, but I told him that I would. You know, my spirit feels fulfilled when, when I can listen back to a song and be moved by it the way I am when I listen to other people's songs, you know? Um, there's a song on the new record. It's called Hey So What, It Opened Up My Heart. I think that's what it's gonna be called. But, and I remember when we finished it, I, I thought, I hope they play that at my funeral, you know? <coughs> and I felt full. I was thinking about the man I thought I'd be. He had confidence as I recall. Lights dancing at his feet. And sometimes we sign up for ain't exactly what it seems. But I was thinking about the man I thought I'd be. And I guess somehow I got a bit distracted.
I've got an open heart.